Hey, this is Jim McBride from Bottle of Blues. Today I want to talk about improvising. One of the best tools you can use to improvise is backing tracks. And uh, today I'm going to talk about John Gindick's Harp Jam. This is a CD full of backing tracks. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a series of videos where I go through each track and give you some ideas on some simple things that you can play to sound great with these. The first one is called Classic BB Style in G minor. It's basically the thrill is gone in G minor. And what I want to demonstrate is that you don't have to play anything complicated. You can just play some simple repetitive riffs and you'll sound great. As a matter of fact, in a lot of cases, simple repetitive riffs are a lot more entertaining for the listener than a complicated solo that wanders all over the place and doesn't make sense. So we're going to be using a bottle of blues mic, Pignose Hog 20 amp, and John Gindick's Harp Jam. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start out and, uh, well, I want to say one other thing. I'm going to be playing in third position. We're going to use an F harp. We're going to play in third position. If you don't know third position, don't worry about it. This is a great chance to learn. We're not going to do anything hard at all. We're going to play out of the four, five, and six hole. That's it, just three holes. The only notes we're going to play are four draw, four blow, five draw, six draw, and maybe a six blow. That's it. Three holes, five notes. Super simple. So once again, the song is in G minor. We're using our F harp in third position, playing out of the four, five, and six hole. Okay, starting out, all I'm going to play is the four and the five blow. After I do that for a little bit, I'll add in a five draw. And then after that, I'll maybe add in a six draw. That's it. Let's start out with just the four draw, four blow. It's coming up to the change. Through the turnaround. You can play that all the way through and sound fine. Six drop. Now let's do the four draw, the four below, and add in a five draw. makes this a minor key song. That's why that note sounds so great. Now let's do four draw and six draw. I did four draw, I put six draw and back to the four draw. So I hope that was enough to give you the idea of what I'm talking about. Um, just a few simple notes, a few simple riffs. It's repetitive, but it all fits and it sounds great. Four draw, four blow. Use the five. Use the six. I actually use the six draw and the six blow. But you can hear it's just three holes, simple riffs, and it sounds great with that minor key groove. So, if you don't have this, get it, or something like it, practice. You'll sound great. Have a great day.